closely. Can you hear that? It's the seldom heard song of the green-eyed bluebird. Oh, Miss Tommy, how splendid, how exciting. Where's the lovely sound coming from, Miss Tommy? Way up there, Mildred. Look up in that treetop. Wait until the Bird Society hears about this. Has anyone seen my brand new roll of duct tape? Sparky took your tape, Chief. Sparky, why on earth? I made this all by myself. You? A wallet? What for? Dreaming of finding a dollar on the sidewalk someday? Where's the rest of my new tape, Sparky? In the trash. I made a couple mistakes. Sparky, what's wrong with you? I have a theory. He's a moron. Listen up, Sparky. There better be a new roll of duct tape on my desk by sundown. Or else. I'll see if the hardware store is running a sale. Hey, wait, look here. Madam Bobo's coming to town? The world's greatest hypnotist, live, in person, at the Mayfield Center. That dumb hypno stuff is all fake. Don't be so sure, Sparky. I saw Madam Bobo on the late night show. It looked pretty real to me. Ghosts, spirits, spells, it's a big bunch of baloney. Don't diss the dark side, Sparky. Come on guys, let's go check it out. The matinee starts in 10 minutes. To the DRT-300 mobile unit, man. Big Mayfield welcome to the greatest hypnotist on earth, Madam Bobo. Woo! Hi everyone and thank you. I need a volunteer from the audience. Would someone please join me here on stage? Thank you, sir. My name is Madam Bobo. And what's yours? Hank. Very well then, Hank. Have you ever been hypnotized before? No, oh, ma'am. Excellent. Now relax and listen carefully. You are feeling very sleepy. Watch the magic spoon, Hank. Are you asleep? Yes, Madam Bobo. Hank, do you like fish? Yes, I do, Madam Bobo. Do you like frogs? Yes, Madam Bobo. Very well, then. When I clap my hands together, you will hop around like a frog. Understand? Yes, Madam Bobo. Now watch the magic spoon. When I count to three, he will awaken. One, two, three. So, Hank, do you recall what just happened? I'm not sure. Ribbit, 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 ribbit. Oh. Your name, please? I'm Sparky, and your whole act is a bunch of hooey. Really? Watch the magic spoon, Sparky. You are feeling very sleepy. Sparky's out like a light. This is gonna be good. Do you like chickens, Sparky? They're okay. What about ducks? Yeah, I guess. When you hear the word duck, you will become a duck. If you say so. Concentrate on the magic spoon, Sparky. When I snap my fingers, you will awaken. 
Yeah, so when are you going to st start all your hypnotic junk? Right now, if you insist, Sparky. Swan. Goose. Duck. Quack! 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 What a dope! I sure wish Captain Clip were here to see this. Captain Cliff speaking. Oh, hi, Captain Cliff. How's it going back there? Just the usual dangerous rescues, Chief. Really miss you. Coming back soon? I don't think so, Captain. Bachelor Island is number one in the ratings. They're filming a romance special starring me next week. That sounds boring. <laughs> oh, yes. It gets so boring being chased by adorable bachelors every night. Don't let them catch you, Chief. Don't worry, Captain. They won't catch me. Unless I let them. Oh, brother. Bye-bye, Captain Cliff. Hey, Captain Rocky. We got a dangerous situation down here on Forest Road. Get down here quick. There it is. I see it. The green-eyed bluebird. Clear this area immediately. Don't you dare talk to Miss Tommy like that. This is a free country. What did the terrible man say, Mildred? I have my hearing aid turned down. He said he doesn't like birds. Now listen here, young man. We may be seniors, but that does not mean you can push us around. We're tax-paying citizens, and Miss Tommy is a veteran. No, no, you don't understand, folks. Can't you see the power lines are sparking? I can't see anything! What did you say, Sonny? You saw a buzzard? Now why don't you just leave us alone? <coughs> why don't you go and find some criminals to push around? You guys got here just in time. These sweet elderly folk are in a dangerous situation. I see what you mean. Those wires are gonna blow any minute. 50,000 volts at least. Enough juice to fry a whole nursing home. I'm not going back under there. Too dangerous. I agree. Looks like a job for you, Sparky. I kind of figured that. Attention, old people. Get out of here now. Like this, I'll make a big complaint. Get your chains and beat it. Scram, you geezers. Get your creaky butts in gear. Look out, Sparky. The cable's coming right at you. Watch out, duck. Fifty thousand volts. That's gotta hurt. You were in the intensive care unit for 48 hours, Sparky. How are you feeling now? Oh, just peachy, Captain Rocky. It would have been cool if you died. Thanks, goth chick. All right, Sparky, the sun's going down. Where's my new roll of duct tape? Did somebody just say duck? Quack, 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 quack. What the? Are you mocking me, Sparky? All right, that does it. Grab a seat, Scully. This is gonna be good. Cue the frying pan. Run, little buddy, run! <laughs> 